turn in for us. We just got home from church. We had to teach children's church today. So we had to get there early. We had to stay later and we had a good time. We love going down there with the kiddos and our kiddos love when we go down there with them. So it was fun. Um, but it is a nasty rainy day today. I didn't even attempt to straighten my hair today after I got out of the shower. I was like, mm -mm, I'm just gonna put on a braid because it is pouring. It has been pouring since we woke up. It's gonna pour all through today and tonight. So, um, um, yeah, I don't know. I made some sausage, toast, eggs, things like that for breakfast this morning. The pineapple. I cut up a pineapple yesterday. We had it for dinner and then again for breakfast this morning, finished it off. Um, and it was like the perfect pineapple. It was sweet. It was amazing. Um, and then, so I don't know what we're going to do for lunch. Honestly, we just got home from church. The kids have snack down there late. I'm not hungry. I don't think Gary's hungry. Um, are you hungry? No, I'm not. She's just walking around. I'm just checking around. Um, hey, I don't know what we're going to have for lunch. If we'll all even like make a lunch or we'll just kind of like nitpick a little bit because, um, like I said, the kids get snacked downstairs for church and we had a big breakfast, like filling breakfast. And I don't know. I think we'll just kind of make things as people get hungry versus me like making a lunch. We have left a couple leftover burgers. So if and when somebody gets hungry, we can do something, something like that or like a sandwich or just whatever. Um, and then for dinner tonight, we're going to have ribs. I have ribs, baked potatoes, mac and cheese, and baked beans on um, my menu. I can't decide if I want to do baked potatoes or twice baked potatoes again because I've been on a kick with those ever since I made them that first time. I'm like wanting them constantly now. So I might make those, but then again, I might not. I might just throw the baked potatoes in there because it's really simple. So that's going to be our dinner. And it's just the pre-done ribs from Sam's Club. So all I have to do is pop in the oven and bake it. So I don't really have any work to do for most of that besides making the mac and cheese. Everything else is mostly just heating it up. So dinner will be simple but delicious. All right. Well, that didn't last long. The kids ended up being hungry and they wanted a burger for lunch. So leftover burgers for lunch it is. Nice. In the interest of saving money. If you watched my video yesterday, I talked about saving money on groceries. Um, I didn't buy any mayonnaise when I need mayonnaise. I figured I could just make it. I have all the ingredients to make it. So we're going to make it and save what? Three, four or $5. So I have one cup of avocado oil in here. I'm going to do the juice of half of a lemon. tablespoon of vinegar a pinch of salt and one egg oh no no eggshells though we're gonna immersion blend this up anything today because it is so rainy outside we haven't done much at all we've just been kind of relaxing watching movies i just finished a book on my kindle so just things like that like nothing to even film um we did go outside in the pouring down rain and feed animals which obviously i couldn't film that either because it was nasty rainy wet and almost impossible to not slip and slide everywhere i will ask gary's like how are you walking so fast i'm like walking like this because it's so muddy outside. And he's like, and I'm like, how are you doing that? Because every time I take a step, I'm sliding everywhere in the mud. Anyway, these are the ribs that we're gonna eat from Sam's Club. So I think I bought them twice, maybe. Um, and then, like, I think I bought them one time and then I bought them again another time without having them the first time. Um, they're okay, they're good. They're not the best. They're really great for nights like this where you just want to throw something in the oven. So I don't know, honestly, that I will always buy these, but like I said, they're really good for just a quick, easy dinner. Like you just turn the oven on 375 and put them in for 25 minutes. You can't really beat that. So that's what we're going to do tonight for dinner. So let's see, 375. 
Um, our potatoes are done in the Instant Pot. I need to pull those out and like just put them on a plate in the microwave or something just to, I don't know, put them somewhere. Um, and then I need to put some noodles in the Instant Pot because I'm going to make some mac and cheese. And then I'm going to heat up some baked beans. And that's it. I mean, like I said earlier, dinner is just so simple tonight. And that's what I love about meals like this, though, is it's just super quick. And... I don't know, it's just been a nice lazy day. I want to continue with our nice lazy nice lazy day um, without having to, I don't know, be standing in the kitchen forever on a Sunday. Sundays are long days, especially when we serve at church and we have to get there like really early and then we have to stay late too. So, um, I don't know, it just kind of takes a lot out of you after, you know, like the whole after church nap kind of thing, except I don't nap because... I can't sleep at night as it is. So if I nap, I really can't sleep at night. So, um, yeah, let me get these ribs out and I'll show you what they look like before they go in the oven. So they're already fully cooked. You're just heating them up when you pop them in the oven. They're not that expensive. I think they're like $11 maybe for the wrap. Maybe. I don't even know. I don't remember, honestly. So when the oven preheats, I'll throw these in there. Now we'll get these potatoes out. I don't have um, baked potato loving kids, so I don't need that many potatoes. That's why I'm also making mac and cheese. So now I need to wash this out real quick. And I'm just gonna cook these noodles in the Instant Pot. I just cook these on three minutes and then let the pressure out right when um, it finishes. I also pulled this out of the freezer for tomorrow's dinner because we're going to have some chicken. So I needed it thawed because I'm going to do a crock pot meal. So I need this in the morning. Well, not in the morning, morning, but like I need it thawed. I need it thawed before it would thaw if I were to wait until the morning. So I just went ahead and pulled this out and I'm going to go ahead and put this in the fridge. I pulled it out earlier. It's still very frozen though. So, um, but I think I'm just going to put it in the fridge until tomorrow and it'll be thawed by the time I need it. Now I'm gonna make some mac and cheese. So ooh, I have to make two different kinds, a regular and one for Layla. So I'm gonna pull some of these noodles out. Everything else is heating up. The ribs are in the oven. The baked beans are warming up. So I'm gonna put hers in here. with her cheese and some milk. And some salt and pepper on both. Some butter milk and cheese. dinner is done. Here are the ribs when they come out of the oven. So not a bad buy for a quick and easy night, like I said. Baked beans, baked potatoes, mac and cheese, and mac and cheese. guys we are in the process of getting everybody down for bed so i just want to say thank you guys so much for watching and i will see you tomorrow with another new video bye